Hello, Paul Brooks, aka Beanie Man on Stereo to Go and Paul Brooks on Facebook. Here's my video response. You stated here, as we can see in the uh, Stereo to Go website, that uh, you're on Facebook and you had me and your friends list, and I was okay. Used to get along with him. Even stood up for him on Stereo to Go, and we got along on Facebook until we both joined the Boog Box group. I think it was there first, but I don't matter. I'm not. It's not not a big huge deal. Anyway, I up and then he. You go on to say that you uploaded some pictures for everyone's viewing enjoyment. Uh, Jumbo Disco Light a nine 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 seventy five, and and then you said that I did nothing but slate them and said these boxes are uh, stuff and stuff. And no, I didn't say that. Um, you need to you know, show where I put these bad statements, okay? Anyhow, you said for me to stop it, you told me that you uploaded the pictures to the other members. Well, th this is a public thing, Facebook, right? And um, if you don't want people making comments on your pictures, um, then you shouldn't post them, okay? I make videos, such as I'm making this one here, for people to either like them or lump them or whatever. I'm, it's not my issue, okay? Uh, I just put it out there for the information being out there because the information has never been out there from before. That's why I make these videos, okay? Anyhow, you go on to say, um, uh, the final straw was he shared a link to a video about a GF999 with LEDs in it and all that, and I said, yawn. That's all I said, one word. I said, John, well, I've seen it before. I've seen it about a month ago. <clears throat> and in there, let me see here. Where is that picture? Here's the picture here of the happy video that, um, and right down here, if you can, wait, I need to zoom this out, I guess, some, right? You know, let me zoom this out a bit so you can see it. And then let me zip into my happy little comment there. You see the comment there? Is it? Well, anyway, I'll let you figure it out. Okay, but I, I made that nice little comment there. And he goes on to say, what does he say? He goes on to say that, um, anyway, that I had said something bad about this video. And it, when, in fact, I did not say anything at all bad. And I don't see any of your comments in this happy video. Of course, I don't know what your name is on YouTube. And I'm not, not, not my issue anyhow. Okay, so let's see here. The final straw was yawn. Yeah, that was it. And of course, and I said, of course, you have to remember for every video that I take the time to view, I place comment or question in whatever video. And in this case, I liked the LEDs as I had to show Paul Brooks, who was going off the deep end and attempting to state that I was dissing everything. But I proved him wrong by showing him that over a month ago, when I did video view the video in question, that I'd placed a comment there. So, where's yours, Paul? Said he couldn't take it. Then Paul goes on to say, couldn't take it anymore. Well, yeah, you couldn't take it because, um, you know, you, we're not even beginning with all the guff I have to take by reading all this garbage here. Some of it might be true. Some of it is definitely not true. But there is no documentation to back it up properly, right? So, anyhow. Uh, let's see, what else can I rattle on about here? Let's see. Then I accused you of... Pay, I, okay, yeah. Alright, let's go back to this. In the... Um, do to do Okay, here we go. Let's go to the uh, happy website right there. There we go. Yeah. What's his first little comp... Okay, I said yawn. Okay. Wow. Big deal. She... Oh my God, the world's going to come to an end here. And what does Paul start out by saying here? He starts out by saying, Big yawn at reading comments of you criticizing everything. Show me everything, okay? You uploaded for pure entertainment. Maybe you haven't seen this, but maybe the other guys haven't. Just chill. I'm chill, okay? I said back to Paul, I said, Hey, Paul. I said, John, as I had seen this over a month ago, and there's the picture to prove it, where is the negative criti critique in the happy video? 
that you text stuff before you start saying stuff that you have no idea what you're texting about and maybe you just want to stir up something I guess and before you leap off the deep end you need to get your facts correct forwards and backwards as it is here evidence that you did not do your homework and I am very chill good day and cheers well that was posted what about a week ago or so and Paul comes back and then he banters back and forth and says that I am wrong about all this and it's like man I'm an individual the same as you I said okay you can read the rest of this. I'm not gonna voice all the rest of this but anyway I accused him of picking on this yes he did you did Paul in text at the very beginning as I stated the only comeback to would be to start up something over nothing nothing right okay in the end he got sick of arguing with him I'm not arguing I was stating facts as I know of them he defended and left the group okay well that's your prerogative to leave the group I refuse to be wrong that's not true I agreed to be having an individual opinion my word not wrong or incorrect is simply my singular opinion okay ah <sighs> uh, see here I was uh, he that oh and then you go on to say that I'm right and everyone else is wrong madness the madness is reading this stuff above here and I have never said that anything is wrong or bad or well maybe I, okay I I have to agree I dislike um, I dislike jumbos uh, I just I th jumbos and um, the really humongous boom boxes the, the, just I don't like them and I don't I'll I'll say something to that effect and that's about all I know so that's been my rant okay and my voice reading your happy little comments there on Facebook and on stare to go you know five hours ago as you see it wait let me zip out so you can see it was was five hours ago because I'm getting kind of tired of having to um, oh that's the wrong button there we go I'm getting kind of tired of having to uh, defend myself here where I'm not allowed to defend myself so I'm gonna put this out here to the world for everyone to see okay I'm not afraid of anybody or anything I don't lie like all this text is lies some may be true but the most of it is lies there's no fact and like I proved with my little picture here that I took of over a month ago that I'd said something nice or something period but you want to you know keep running on this uh, thing well we we can keep right on talking okay I've, I've had my say you let's hear your say okay or you can call me on the phone if you know my number like um, like a particular person did from India about a month ago it really surprised the heck out of me I really appreciate that doctor anyhow um, wish I was still back on this happy website you know but uh, once again the uh, the issue for this whole column here is because um, I sold something to somebody that I had no idea that they were gonna do whatever they did with it and all that and this was a private matter that went public and um, went public right so like uh, isolator said over wherever he said it um, let's see yes he's a bit loopy but it was scratched beneath the surface many people in some way or another are that's not so special I know what he was doing and when I did it I didn't do the right thing over that deal gone bad well that's that may be true the thing is this deal went public to the world now, when was the last time you bought something from a merchant or whatever and you didn't like it and you took it back and the merchant videotaped your entire transaction and blasted it out to the world that's what happened here had this remained private this would have been solved privately but no somebody had to stick their nose in and here we are and here I am have a good day bye bye